he's like, he, I bet you Jeremiah goes, I can't, nothing. I says, tell me what you see. He goes, oh, it's not even, it's not a name, it's not a number, it's not a detail, it's not a... He said, what do you see? He said, an almond tree blossoming in winter. God said, you've seen well. I will hasten my word to perform it. You think you're seeing nonsense. You think your dreams, you're seeing rubbish. But sometimes the reason why we think what we're seeing is rubbish is because we cannot find the current context for the thing we're seeing. Yet if you steward that level well, so what did he say when Miriam spoke against Moses? I said, were you not afraid to speak against Moses? He said, when there's a prophet amongst you, I speak in visions, in the Bible says, dark sayings, enigmas, puzzles, not with Moses. He is faithful. Do you see that? When you're faithful, faithfully stewarding the level you're at now in the prophetic, that's when God will give you the next level of the prophetic. But if you're not faithful with the image, the picture, the vague, maybe you're laying hands on someone, you're asking for the name, but all you're seeing, I remember somebody, all they were seeing was a, a broom banging against a washing machine. I said, God, what is this? So the person kept saying, uh, the person told the husband, all I keep seeing is a, they were dealing in inner healing with this woman, said, all I keep seeing is a broom. The husband said, just keep praying. She said, I keep seeing the same thing. Finally, she just said it. Excuse me, I just keep seeing a broom banging him against the washing machine. The girl went into deliverance instantly. Afterwards, she came out and says, what did that mean? She said, when I was younger, my parents locked me every day in this room. And the fear I had because the broom would rattle against that washing machine over and over and over again. See, sometimes because it doesn't mean something to you, you throw it away. Yet it means something to God. So the first level of seeing angels, maybe you, for you angels wear white, and you're, you know, they're, so now that's all you see. Maybe when you see Jesus, because you watch too many Jesus movies, you see the passion of Christ Jesus. That, that will be Jesus. Maybe when you're dreaming, you see me come into your room and lay hands on you. You don't know you're seeing Jesus. He's just taking on a form you recognize to deal with you. How many people have seen the Lord and they don't know it? They say, I saw the host come to me in a dream. You don't know you really saw it. You had an encounter with Jesus. I saw you, apostle, come into my room and you gave me keys. And then you started washing my feet. You don't know you just had an encounter with Jesus. He just 